How are you doing, Barb? I'm good. Thanks for asking, Captain. I wanted to start off this morning asking you a couple questions. So first of all, you're one of the largest golf cart dealers in the nation. What's next for Captain Smithy? You see, I'm glad you asked, Barb. I was tired of hearing all of our customers talk about how great our customer service is and how well we ran the organization. So I decided to take the next step and run for all of the American people. What makes you think that you're a qualified candidate? Again, I'm glad you asked, but I'm just gonna say this. I am the most qualified candidate since there have ever been candidates. Abraham Lincoln, if he had the technology, would have called me and asked for my campaign advice. Can you tell me what office you're running for? America, Barb. America. What kind of questions are these? I was supposed to be on with Oprah. Well, that's not an office. So what exactly are you running for? You see, if you prefer to store your premium golf cart in an office, I'm not going to step on your personal liberties. However, I would recommend parking our premium vehicles in the garage. Okay. Um, why do you think anybody would vote for you? You don't even have a real person's name. You see, everyone in this great country deserves to know and be one with Captain Smithy. That is not debatable. Okay, one last question. If you wanted everybody in this country to know one thing about Captain Spiffy, what would it be? You see, America, this country has become twisted. And as Captain Spiffy likes to say, we need to get it untwisted. Okay? So, our goal, America, is to provide you with a feeling of content. And how do we do that? By not getting it twisted. As you can see, Barb untwisted it. And she's Captain Spiffy for life.